everybody, we're back again with Hearthstone. It seems to be our game of game of choice to actually do recording together at the moment. Well, I think Hearthstone works well just because um, you can get a lot of quick matches in, unlike um, I know I suggested Magic the Gathering the other day, but that is quite um, oh, intensive, God. isn't it? Uh, yeah, yeah, my brain can't cope with that very much. Right, <laughs> so basically, what we're doing in this video. It is, there's been quite a lot of changes, well, some changes, uh, content updates for people vaguely interested in what the hell we're meant to be doing here, and a few, uh, and basically me saying, yes, yes, I am getting my arse in gear, we are going to have some more content from me, I promise. <laughs> <laughs> so, in the, while we're doing that, we're going to be playing some Hearthstone. Yeah. We so decks I just made up today actually so I've got no idea if any of these are going to work or not I've got my plain old boring decks because frankly I got some more decks um, over the Christmas period and none of them are any good for what I normally play so talk you of nothing good that describes this starting hand <laughs> uh, I've no idea if it's any good so I'm just going to keep it I don't play Hearthstone that much. So, shall we get ourselves started with what we were talk what we wanted to talk about? Well, I think one of the first things was we were going to discuss the um, change of channel name and yeah, Base. how, why, and what to do and where and why and what to. Yeah, basically, <laughs> bastard. Basically, what some of it, <laughs> what has happened is as you may have noticed i've changed the name of the channel i did this because for a number of reasons one governor e marley was a f bitch of a name to say and it <laughs> and it was a bit like blah, 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 blah. yeah yeah i know that's me yeah no that is actually me nope yeah okay fine so i was having a long think and i thought well if i'm going to change it Let's change it away from something that isn't copyrighted. That probably makes sense. Yeah. So, another persona that I actually use is Amalfia, who is uncopyrightable, because it's the name of a Greek um, uh, a character in Greek, uh, Greek mythology. And, you know, general gaming, Amalfia gaming. Yep, that, that's basically how it went. So, I'm having a persona change, because I can. <laughs> That makes sense. Yeah. Vlad's still going to be heavily involved in the channel. More involved than me, uh, uh, as he's been more involved with me up till now. <laughs> well, I'm always involved with you, dear, but we just don't tell your husband. <laughs> oh, dear, because that, that just got me in a whole world of hurt. Thank you. <laughs> oh, come on. It was the obvious comment. Oh, don't I know it. So, um, yes, so that's still going to be producing content. It's still the same format. It's just a name change, which is easier to say and less likely to get me a copyright strike for my name, which does mean those of you who have uh, chased us on face, uh, followed us on Facebook, I do have to go through and change that. I haven't done it yet. I know it's on my very long to do list. Uh, I was going to ask about that actually, whether we were going to look at um, doing the Facebook page as well, or... Well, that's the plan. Oh, bugger. <laughs> I should really read what this stuff does before I kill stuff. <sighs> well, in fairness, I don't think killing either of the other two would have got you much better results. No, it, it is like, I've got to get rid of something on this screen. So, yes, the Facebook uh, page is going to get changed when I get around to figuring out how. And, yeah, so that's that's the current plan. And you should all be following the Facebook page because um, I've recently started following a number of sites that do um, game giveaways and cheap games and that sort of thing and I've been posting the occasional links on Facebook 
I've actually yeah. put two more up today where there are sites giving away um, free game codes. Mm. So anyone who watches the channel but isn't following Facebook yet, the link's in most of the um, video descriptions. Click it, like it. Do whatever. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Oh, balls, I didn't want to play that. I was kind of hoping you'd kill my um, sludge belch first there. <laughs> okay, I'm not 100% sure why that's important, but I'm sure I'll find out. <clears throat> well, that secret you just triggered, effigy. Yes. When a minion dies, summon another minion of the same cost. Woohoo! And, and the sludge belcher costs more than the... Um, Golem that you killed, so I was hoping for a better um, <laughs> helping for a, a better, better deal. Fair enough. Um, yeah, well, not I can do about that one. Um, frankly, because I forgot that that character did that when I when I um, uh, played it. <laughs> yes, you can see how often I play this game when I can't remember what my cards do and I just play them randomly. Right. So ah, go away. I've just realised that one of the cards in my hand is absolutely useless in this deck. Oh, well, that, that makes me happy. <laughs> uh, well, this is not going to be fun or pretty. Ooh. Hello. Hello, goodbye. <laughs> Hello some more. I did say it wasn't going to be fun or pretty. I was I was very clear on the this is not going to be fun or pretty. <laughs> right. So, uh, also I will be posting from now and then stuff that comes up on Origin. Like right now, if you're watching this video over the next couple of weeks, right now, Jade Empire, uh, the Bioware RPG is currently going free on Origins. I will be posting it on face on Facebook. Um, if you haven't got it, or you want a Nostalgia Fest or have never played it, I would, it's a Bioware RPG, you know, they are basically godly. Um, why do I call? I don't know why I bloody call. Um, <laughs> that was actually useful. Um... Yes, Jade Origins is up, and I, uh, Jade. One more time. Yes, now I've forgotten what the name of the game is called. Jade Empire, that was it. And it's a special edition ver version. So, yeah, if you're interested in old RPGs, go grab it. It's free. <sighs> um, yeah, I'll be posting that on Facebook later. Right, so. Uh, that's that done. Okay. And that's also the first match done. <laughs> yep. For anyone who's interested, that deck, um, I've called it the Summoner. Basically, every card in it has the possibility to summon a creature somehow. So you saw with those two eggs, when they're destroyed, they um, created some 4-4s. Four um, the sludge belch when it was killed created a one two and yeah that's the theme of that deck i'll probably be doing a video on that at some point to demonstrate it a bit more oh i don't think this deck is gonna work well against a mage <laughs> well there's the first time for everything that something that i've created actually works well against something else <clears throat> <clears throat> On to our next topic. Which topic would you like next? Channel content. As people know, I have a number of unfinished series on my channel. Some of which will be being completed, some of them won't. Chan if they're any that I've started, they probably won't. <laughs> mm. Well, I'm just going through... Oh, 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 oh. Oh, okay, he's very cute. He's very cute. I want him. Fear the Robo Cub. No, I just want him. Have I got him? Have I? I need to know if I've got him in WoW because I'm fairly sure he'd be a WoW uh, a WoW um thing. 
pet if he's in here. He's so cute. So cute, he's, so cute, so cute. He's quite nice for a two mana creature as well. Torn, and you can either give it plus one attack or plus one health. Oh, it's not that. I wasn't looking at that. I was looking at how cute he was. <laughs> He's so cute. Anyway, sorry, I got distracted by the cute by the cute mechanical bear. Um, so we were discussing series. This is yes, right. Um, now, I did have a mental list. I'm not sure if I can remember it all. Okay, so the series I have running, Kingdoms of Amalur, is being canned. It's a very good game. Don't get me wrong. That's not the issue. The issue with that game is I have no idea what I'm doing. It's seeming to be. Very long-winded. I know it was meant to be a blind playthrough and therefore meant to be a bit like I don't know what I'm doing. But I'm not, I don't feel at the moment I have the time to really give that game what it what it deserves. So I'm probably just going to can it. Um, maybe come back with a fresh look at it in the future. But right now, mm, no. Um, it kind of makes... When I can't talk about games because I don't know what's coming, it makes them difficult. Well, that makes sense. Mm. So, the next one is uh possibly is the Don't Starve series. Well, it's good. Well, it's good. It's not it's there's been a hell of a lot of updates between now and then. So, I'm probably going to just Ooh, come on, come on. There we go. That solved that. Uh, I'm probably just going to leave that for now. And if we come back to maybe playing Don't Starve together, or there is a new uh, thing came out called Don't Starve Shipwrecked, which looks which looks interesting. So I may um, have a look at that. Um. There was another one. I can't remember what it was. Basically, the two series that I have currently ongoing, which I intend to continue, are the Dragon Age ones. I will, I am determined to complete the Dragon Age DLC for Origins and get that done and out. And Kator. I love that game. I hate that I've had to, I've had, I've left it so long, but there are reasons and it's time for me to get off my backside and fix those reasons so i can actually finish it well that <sighs> sounds like some good stuff to look forward to yep in the future of course i'm going to be doing my um uh, monkey island 3 playthrough which i have started a couple of times and for various reasons have had to not um complete it and have to start all over again um, how many cards can you have in your hand at once? Ten. That's okay. Uh... Ooh, here comes the coin into a night blade. Yeah. That's actually mildly irritating. Hmm. Especially when I don't know what that secret is. <laughs> um. Yes, so in the future, there's going to be uh, carrying on with Monkey Island. Like I said, possibly ship uh, possibly uh, Don't Starve Shipwrecked. Um, ah, Mirror Entity, okay. <laughs> oh, his battle cry doesn't work. Doesn't doesn't uh, pop when, when you mirror image it. No. That Ooh. Was that was kind of why I played him, because I thought it might be a mirror entity, and I thought, right, well, let's um, deal with that then. Yep. Oh, that's just evil. Um, what else was I going to do? I have I have got plans, I have got games that I have... Um, thing. Uh, I have got... Uh, definitely going forward the one of them that is definitely not coming making an appearance back is <coughs> anything to do with wow love it love it to death still actively playing it on my own but i i cannot do it i cannot do it so there'll be no more wow on this channel 
Unless somebody else wants to record and uh, record and talk over it. That um, doesn't seem likely, does it? No. No. And frankly, there'll probably be no more MMOs outright. I play MMOs to have uh, to socialise with my friends, not to try and attempt to talk over. It's just not pretty. Shall I? Yes, people like Wild Crendor can do it to the cows come home and I wish them every joy. Uh, right. Possibly not the one I should have done there. Oh no, if it was me, I would have killed the Sunwalker personally, but... Yeah, you know, the one with five attack. Just, just a... Have you met my friend, the Annoyatron? No, I haven't met the Annoyatron. Um, there was some other stuff that I wanted, I was going to think about playing, but I never wrote any notes. I didn't write any notes. So... And we're just making it up as we go along. Yeah, pretty much. So... What have you got planned for the future, my dear? Well, um, for the immediate future, I'm going to take charge on that and knock you down to zero health. Sorry about that, dear. As far as content goes, um, I've got f five new decks that I've created in the last day or two for Hearthstone. So there'll probably be some videos coming for those. I've also got another three older decks that I'm going to be releasing videos on. So if you like um, second-rate decks built out of um, random cards, then you're probably in luck. For anyone who is interested, that um, druid I was playing is um, actually inspired by um, Amalthea. Is that how you're pronouncing it, dear? I don't. Yeah, Amalthea, that's how you pronounce it. Thank you. That is my um, all taunt deck. Every creature in there has something to do with taunt. It was kind of um, <coughs> inspired by your warlock deck. Ah, great. I and we'll probably it. be seeing some more of that um, in the future. I also picked up a lot of cheap games one way or another um, over the Christmas sale. I've got a couple of them that I think short videos on could be um, quite interesting. Uh, ah, I haven't seen this! Oh yeah, this is the um, Feast of Wintervale. Um, but, but the Feast of Wintervale's over! Not in WoW, it is not yeah, in Hearthstone, it isn't, sorry about... dear. <laughs> I'm confused. Yeah, it's, it's well and truly over. Oh, the, the, the actual Christmassy stuff doesn't do anything. I know, it is just cosmetic, it isn't. Um... Uh, I can't do anything, but it's all pretty and Christmassy. Yes, we're doing this like for a week, um, a week after the New Year, so... If we play enough matches, we might get some of the new League of Explorers backgrounds as well. Mm. Yeah, um, yeah, only if we actually... How do we do that? Well, they are just random. Um, I meant uh, like this arena here. There are some oh. new with the new... Um... Is that out yet? It is, yeah. It came mm. out a couple of weeks ago. Or... Yeah. It See? was definitely before Christmas. Mm. I knew it was coming out. Yes. Ah. Oh. Mm. That's not the one I wanted. Misha, I really wish you were half a right now. <laughs> I'm fairly sure he knows what that is. Uh, animal compa- Ah, right, got it. Um, so, is anything... Yeah, so we have got content planned. Hopefully, I want to get a big chunk of recording done over the next couple of mm. uh, weeks, and then I'll start pumping it out. I have potentially got two other um, series that might um, 
now that I've got a bit more familiar with the settings of the recording software I'm using, I might um, take another look at getting some more amnesia done. One yeah. of the reasons that series stalled is because my um, recording quality was absolute rubbish. But um, I've been fiddling with settings, and I think I can do a better job of it now. <laughs> Us being competent? Um, I don't think this is something that we do, is it? No. And there's also, um, I posted an Elder Scrolls Online video which was a little tour of one of my favourite um, wood elf locations. Ah, Elder Scrolls Online. That is another game you will never see me recording on my channel. Uh, on this channel. Um, oh god, go away. <laughs> so, to... I might try another couple of those, because there are some really interesting locations, I think, and just having a little walk around and um, discussing them. It's a nice way to spend some time. Yes, yes. Yeah. It's a good game, I suppose. Um, but it's not well. And I, I try and people go, Oh, it's better than WoW and I go, Really? Convince me. You're not convincing oh. me. Couldn't you have thrown the dagger at the deck hand? Obviously not. Why I've... does that well, if Knife Juggler had thrown the dagger at the deckhand, he'd be dead and I wouldn't have to run any creatures into him. Now I kind of need to do that, which wasn't what I wanted to do. You really want me dead. Oh, and we're giving him on the end another sword, okay. <clears throat> so yeah, potentially I've got about four series there that um, I'm hoping to get some more content out on. Bye bye Misha. Mm. Um, so, definitely stuff coming, hopefully. Maybe. Hopefully. Yes. <laughs> yes. Fingers crossed. Um, Let's run the knife juggler into it because he's been absolutely useless so far. So, after that, um, yeah, so what's generally news wise? Um, Steam sales seem to cause a bit of a problem for people. I hope everyone, ca uh, I hope everyone's accounts are, uh, are secure. Yeah, well, from what I've heard and what they've been saying is it was um, showing cached versions of the pages and so you could look but not touch in effect, which mm. obviously, if you had any particular personal information on Steam, doesn't help a great deal, but it does mean that um, nobody would have you know, had money or games or whatever <laughs> stolen or... Mm, they couldn't complete checkouts yeah if you had one there but yeah which is handy but still not fun or pretty no um yes of course um i know this is old news but legion's coming out next year woohoo can't wait for that that's uh high on my games i want for that for uh this year uh, Overwatch, I'm kind of got a big question mark over because it's it's a it's a game of a genre I don't normally play at all, ever, absolutely never. So to have to basically turn around and say hmm, I might give this a go is a little bit like mm, I'm not sure I want to pay forty quid plus to give a go to that. Um. I keep getting nagged by various people to play Borderlands. Uh, so I might have to end up picking up that in the, in the future. Mm. Mm. I've, I've got Borderlands somewhere and it's... I liked it, but... I wouldn't necessarily say it would have been your sort of thing. No, but it's cheap. And yeah. b better, better figure out if I can stand that kind of game before I get Overwatch. 
at full price. I... Because I do like Blizzard games. I do. I'm ki- I kind of get every Blizzard game that comes out. I play Hearthstone, I play Heroes of the Storm, I play Starcraft and Diablo. and <laughs> You know, oh. if, I, if, if it's a Blizzard game, I play it. I really wouldn't have said Borderlands is a good um, comparison to Overwatch, really. You... Yes, I don't know. It's a, it's a, it's a shootery type thing. I know the the one that everyone says, oh, it's reskin Team Fortress. Yeah. Well, Borderlands is more four players with some RPG-ish elements and a lot of shooting. Mm. Whereas Overwatch, from what I've seen, is more of a team versus team shoot each other thing. Yeah, it's kind of a first-person shooty MOBA kind of deal, from what I can tell. Yeah. Which is weird, because I like Smite, which is a first-person shooty MOBA of a sort. It's more first-person than any of the other MOBAs. I don't know. Uh, I might see if there's a starter edition. They normally come out with a starter, a starter edition. But I'm miss- But then I might miss all the nice uh, all the nice, sexy things that you get for ordering big editions of these games. Yeah, from, but, like but my WoW account. They might give you a new pet. <laughs> yeah, yeah, that that is big appeal. A pet, a pet. <laughs> An amount. Or amount. Amount is also good. Yeah. I, yes. <laughs> I like my pets and mounts. We noticed, dear. <laughs> um, Legacy of the Void is out. That's a good get. That's 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 good. Archon mode is interesting. Yeah, bad idea to put me in uh, in a group with uh, a noob and say he can he uh, with uh, my friends and say he can be the archon. Uh, he can archon with you. Yeah. I managed to only be sarcastic with him. Well, that's probably better than I would have done. True. True. I was only sarcastic with him. Going back to the game for a moment, if anyone's interested, that last deck was um, Random Rexar. Every creature in it had some kind of random effect, whether it was randomly summon, randomly do damage this, that and the other You have too many different styles of decks Well <clears throat> there's a um, fairly well known deck called Randorin Win or ha- however you pronounce it mm. and that's quite good but it needs a lot of cards that I don't have so I thought well okay what other classes could you do random with and um, random wrecks are sounded like a good option again there'll probably be a video of that on the channel in the coming weeks mm. oh that's not good yay so that kind of spoils what I was planning to do next. Did I do something good? So have a Death Lord instead. Oh great. Yes. So I've been playing quite a bit of Archon mode, as you can imagine. Uh, I've not got Legacy of the Void yet. I did eventually get Heart of the Swarm and um, complete single player in that app. So, at some point, I probably do need to get Legacy. Oh, this is really not going to be good. <laughs> Hello! I'll give it a shot. Hmm. What are we going to do about this? Oh, that could be quite nice. You mean, mean man. Well, if you look at the effect of Death Lord, it might um, be in your favour, dear. Oh, let's have a look. Hmm. 
true. So you get to swipe it. <laughs> oh, fuck me. <laughs> no, thank you. That's what you always say, dear. It's quite disappointing. Um, I'm not sure this deck has a good answer to that. Oh, sorry about the pop-up in the corner. Sorry. Right. Uh, yeah. Um... Have a sludge belt, sure, I guess. <laughs> I really, really shouldn't have run a Death Lord against a Druid. I should have known that was going to happen. I have not said my prayers to our and Jesus, and he has forsaken me. It's okay, we've got a slime. We may not have an answer to the blooming iron bark protector, but we have a slime. <laughs> Um, that and that, maybe? That might be an answer. Probably dies, though. Yeah, but what's the question? If you... Let's try that. Actually, that was a really stupid idea. Why did I just do that? I have no idea. Why did you just do that? <laughs> Lack of alcohol? Well, yes. I, I can understand why that is a problem. Hmm. Uh, okay. Fear uh... Baron Riven Dare. Okay, let's get rid of that. See, that's why it was a stupid idea, because it was going to immediately kill off half my flipping board. <laughs> On the plus side, it took half of your board with it, so it's not as if I've come out completely um, with yes. nothing to show for it. Yes, but I do still have a... Um... I do still have a minion with taunt on the field. Now I do, do. That's very nice. Yeah, it's gonna bite me in the arse horribly though, but it also means that I can do this. Haha. -ha. Fear my dread steed. Very nice. Oh, not the Baron, I needed him. <laughs> Oh, ours. <laughs> well, at least you killed the Baron first, I suppose. If you'd left the Baron alive, you would have got two creatures out of that. Oh, good point. All the value it has been missed. Well, you know. Never fear, the Dread Steed is going to turn this game around for us. Hello. Is it just like a, an eternal thing then? <laughs> Pretty much. Okay. Well, I was wondering. You see, then I could do that. Mm. And again, this is kind of why I wanted the Baron to still be alive, because he triggers death rattle twice, so every time it yeah, dies, I, I would have got two of it. <laughs> yeah, I know. That's why I got rid of him. Um. My unholy if, army of dread steeds will conquer the land. If if who? Okay, I don't get that death rattle. Uh, uh Starlog and Fugan are two different creatures, and if both of them die during the same game, you can summon a much more powerful creature. In fact, I'm, assu 
I'm kind of tempted to run Starlink into your abomination now. Mostly because I don't have a good other way of clearing your board. Ooh. Ooh, you know what we could do? Oh, what we could... We put that out. Then run into him. He blows up everything. Then I get back. Have at you. Holy f mother of. <laughs> oh, arse. Okay. Well, that's gonna slow me down a tad. Yeah, the problem is it's only a tad. Let's see what I'll get out of the shredder. He'll do. And then maybe we... No, we don't do that. That would be stupid. We run you into you. We run you into you. You into you. Then we do some of that. Some of that. And um, some of that. And then we life tap, which is probably a stupid idea given my health level, but never mind. It may be. You haven't seen my life. You haven't seen my actual, um... Ready for action! For the wild, a minion with talk is in the way. Oh, <coughs> And now, we run these two into here, we play my other Undertaker, and we introduce you to Fugan. They have got both of them. I was worried. And we don't life tap because leaving myself on 10 health. No, don't give him the sword. Bad sword, Smith. You think about what you did. Um. Um. Yeah. Okay, this is rather BM, but this is the other combo I wanted to do. You see this dread, dread steed here? No. Oh no, yes. I can't. I can't do that. I can't do that. That doesn't let me do it either. What I wanted to do is the Undertaker. Whenever you summon a minion with Death Rattle, gain plus one attack. Mm. So if I could kill off the Dread Steed, it would resummon it and it would give the Undertaker another plus one attack. Fun. But we'll just do this instead. And I thought I was doing well then. Well, you did rather panic me when my Dreadlord decided I wanted a flipping 8 8 on the board on about turn 3. And um, <clears throat> that's my um, Deathlock deck. Um, everything in it has to do with death rattles. Oh, fun. Right. Uh, I think that's a good place. Unless there's anything else we need to talk about? Anything else? Um, I can't immediately think of anything. I'm sure. Whenever we have something else, we can um, come up with some more dark decks. <laughs> no, I just have the same four decks, and everyone, uh, everything else just kind of happens. Right. So, like a the overview, we've changed the channel name. Woohoo! It will kind of, sort of, be filtering through to everyone else, everything else in the very near future. Possibly like 10 minutes after I finish recording this video. Um, more content? Woohoo! Oh, the other thing I was going to do, I knew there was, more, there was one more content thing I had to say. Plague Inc. Probably, or sorry, Plague Evolved now, it's changed names. Has multiplayer, so I'm 
probably going to stick a couple of those on my channel. Maybe, um, probably mostly versus randoms. So just kick up a random match and see what I can, and see if I can uh, um, kill the world's population before they can. It's good fun. Um, oh, I was going to ask what multiplayer involves in that game because it's. Um always seemed to me to be a rather single player thing to kill the world uh basically you can there's two uh, there's two uh, modes there's the get as much um get team up with your mate and they'll uh, launch two viruses to work in conjunction with each other to kill the world or there is the versus mode where you load up uh, two two different viruses and you have to basically compete and there's different ways that you can affect the other virus so you can make it more detectable or you can make it harder to um, you can make the immune system of the other per of people who have your virus more resilient to their virus um, and if the longer you remain undetected the more ex uh, the more uh, DNA strands you get to help boost your virus Oh, that um, sounds like it could be interesting then. Yeah, yeah. So if um, I'll be running some game, I, I'm going to try and run some uh, games on that and see how I do. I played one just to get the feel of it and managed to win. Frankly, not sure how. It was kind of like I'm losing this. I'm losing this. Uh, how how did I win? <laughs> All I can assume is that it's because um, he got cured and I didn't. Frankly, because I barely got detected and he did did. No, I never actually found his start zone. But anyway, um, I don't know how I won, but I did. Woohoo! Um, that's always good for a game. You don't know when you win. So yeah, definitely planning on sticking some of those in the channel, and you can see my evil side. Um, yeah. So that was the other thing, and yeah, bits of gaming news. What we'll try and do is, if there's any big gaming announcements like Legion coming out. Um, anything like that, we'll post a video and we'll tag it on to some and say what we think about said new game and while we're there, give general updates about what we're actually doing with the channel and stuff like that. Basically, come watch. Come watch. We're insane and we're fairly incompetent, but we love doing gaming stuff and so come watch us, please. <laughs> <laughs> we don't care. Just come watch us be incompetent. Isn't that right, Vlad? Yes, well, speaking of that, I've, um, just while you've been discussing Plague Inc., released a new video on the channel called um, The Deed. And um, it's a murder simulator, basically. And, okay. And the video that I've just released is me um, trying to get an achievement for getting caught so incompetence springs to mind at the moment so hey it's what we do at the end of the day I'm, that. <laughs> I'm so incompetent I can hear the uh, the, the fans whirring in the background of this video because I can't figure out how to shut the bloody computer up <laughs> or to turn them off so but you know love us please because we do try I'm always very trying this I know this I definitely know. <laughs> right. So, that's us done for now. I'm, I'm going to go off and watch uh, Dollhouse, I think. Uh, so, ta-ta for now. See you soon. Say bye, Vlad. Bye, Vlad. That, gee, that joke isn't like a thousand years old. <laughs> it, it's 11 o'clock at night. My, um, originality switches off at about 10. You're kidding me your originality switches off 10 minutes after you walk in the door after work. <laughs> well, yes, that as well. <laughs> Love you. Well, someone has to. <laughs> night night, boys and girls. Give us a like. If you like us, subscribe, please. That'd be nice to see the numbers go up. Bye-bye.